exactly who she is as soon as she walks in the room. She puts herself out there, every bit of herself. Any event I've been to with Janice, she's going to outdress, you know, the queens and the, and the princes. I mean, she's going to outdress everybody. She is, in fact, a force of nature. When you get a hug from Janice, you could feel the energy. There's like a transfer of energy. There's a transfer of enthusiasm. I've learned so much from her. But then she'll turn around and make a hilarious joke, and she cracks herself up all the time, which I love that. I was thrilled that that was the first uh, nonprofit boy that my wife chose to go on. And it came away, like all of us do, you know, with, uh, you know, my Lord, this woman is, you know, is bigger than life. I mean, her vision, her commitment, her passion. I've met lots of visionaries, and she is right up there in the top. Having a clear vision of what needs to happen uh, and then being able to convince other people that that's the right vision and moreover, they should own it by contributing money to it. A big part of people's willingness to invest in those programs is that Janice has shown the kind of leadership here that people have had great confidence in uh, and have been willing to support her in some risky propositions. The mission here has grown tremendously, and I love the new headquarters. Janice has really built a legacy uh, that will have lasting impact in the Atlanta community for many decades to come. I got to know Janice outside of Big Brothers Big Sisters, and I wasn't prepared for her because she is so many wonderful things all wrapped up into one person. Janice is a three-time breast cancer survivor and she joined our board to really help get the word out, particularly with African-American women because they die of breast cancer much more often than their uh, white counterparts. She's just out and proud about her experience and what she wants to do with it in order to help everyone else. When I became chair of the 100 Black Men of Atlanta, um, and we were working on our mentoring programs and working. Janice became a collaborative partner with us. She really has made a big impact in Atlanta. All the energy she has put into Big Brothers Big Sisters will live here forever, and I can only imagine the legacy she is leaving here. Janice, it's been a pleasure knowing you and working with you these past 25 years. Best wishes in your new endeavors. Thank you, Janice, for all you have done for the community in Atlanta. You are a force. Mwah. God bless you and Godspeed, Janice. Thank you. I hope you keep me on your Rolodex forever and that we continue to find ways to do God's work together. Miss Janice, I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for laying such a great foundation for so many kids, for me especially. You gave us hope. You gave us dreams and I appreciate you and I love you very much for that. Janice, my dear friend, I love you. I think you're spectacular and all I can say is you're a bad sister. I have a feeling this next chapter of your life is going to be every bit as interesting and productive and exciting as the last 25 years. <laughs>